Hello again, everybody. It's the Reverend Jay Goldstein, and welcome to another episode of Activities. And today's activity is going to be Magic Grow Grow Capsules. Yes, Magic Grow Grow Capsules for when redundancy is redundant. And they're from our good friends Jaru from Jacksonville, Florida. And what they are are these little capsules. You place them in water and they grow into fun shapes. Or so it says on the package. So it's illustrated on the package too. And they're made out of uh, soft expanding foam. So this shouldn't be too dangerous. Unless of course you're under four years old. I would like to point out that these are, as usual, a choking hazard, but unlike usual, they actually are a choking hazard. They look like little, you know, capsules, little like Tylenols or something, and they're bright colored like candy, and they're made of soft expanding foam. Need I say more, these are choking hazards. All you other choking hazards, kneel before the expanding foam capsules of Magic Row. And we're going to be having uh, vehicles this time. That is the variety of Magic Row capsules that we have. And these are the shapes that we can expect to see, but in incredible living color, of course. And you see the sailboat, airplanes, cars, everything. Everything you can imagine uh, with a limit of 12 things that are easy to imagine. <clears throat> So, here's uh, some doodads on here, some information, nothing too exciting, but yep, here are the directions. This is what we're going to be actually doing today. Uh, take some water, drop a pill in it, watch the pill, and the pill will become something else. In this case, they'll be vehicles. So, what we're going to need now uh, is some water, and I've already prepared some. I mixed this up this morning in my water laboratory. I'm going to put this right here so you can get a good view of it. There we go. This is ordinary warm water, nothing special in it. But when these capsules go in there, it will become a uh, virtual laboratory. A ecology of Magic Grow capsules. So let's remove these from the packaging, thus destroying their collectible value. Put them right here. And you'll see there, uh, check out the capsules real quick before we uh, dunk them in the water. Just grab this little yellow one here. And yeah, it's just a simple little plastic capsule. Uh, and it's got foam in it. And I'm guessing that whatever the capsule is made out of is going to get absorbed or disintegrated in some way by the water while we watch. So I don't know how long this is actually supposed to take, so let's just drop them in and see what happens. If necessary, we will do some time lapse. Okay, I am concerned because they are not sinking. In the instructions, it distinctly says that these things will, will sink into the water but they are actually floating. Let's see if we can get them to sink by pushing them. No. Why did I think that foam and plastic was going to sink in water? Why did the illustrator think that? Anyway, well, let's watch the show, shall we? Okay, so it's been about five minutes, and let's take a look real quick. Yeah, it seems like everything's gotten a little sticky. See if I can just separate these capsules so they don't stick together when they form. <laughs> they really want to stick together. Okay, if that's what you guys want to do. Um, there seems to be a little bit of a film growing on the capsules, which I guess is the capsules dissolving. So we'll just leave them here for a while and come back and see what's happened later. Okay, it's been about 20 minutes since we put these in here, and let's take a look. We can see that they're all kind of getting a little puffy. Um, I don't know, maybe I'll just grab one here and bring it in front of the camera. You can see it's already starting to uh, be more foam than encapsulated foam. Just kind of shiny, bunched up foam, and still not sinking. Still sticking together. And I'm guessing in about another 5 or 10 minutes, we're going to start seeing some fully formed shapes. This one's almost there. 
and let's watch. Okay, so it's been a little over a half hour since we put these in here, and I, I don't know how long we're supposed to wait, but I wanted to stir them again because, they're, again, they're sticking together, and they seem to be coming to shape. So I wanted to give them that chance. It looks like some of them are almost whatever it is they're supposed to be, assuming I did this right. So let me just uh, mix it up, and uh, we'll be back as soon as they're done. So it's been about an hour and let's take a look. Um, they seem to be in various stages of expansion. Some of them still in their capsule shape. Some of them starting to look more like fun expanded foam shapes. But I think they need a little bit more time. So we're going to leave them alone, stir them up one more time, and then come back when they're done. Okay, it's been 90 minutes. Uh, let's see what we've got. I think 90 minutes is about as much time as we really need for something like this to uh, fully expand. And let's compare to our little diorama here what it is that we've gotten. Okay, so we can identify any. I see already, I see the, uh, the jet airplane right there. Excellent. And some of them are in better expansion than others. This is the, um, what is this? Is this a train? Or a boat? It's a, oh, this is the steamship. This is the steamship over here. This is the train. Looks pretty good. The train looks pretty good over here. Uh, let's put it in its place. On its grid. See what else looks like it's uh, fully formed here. This is the uh, truck. So that is the truck over here. This is going to need a little help expanding. Seems to have gotten uh, lost along the way, bunched up. And I think this is the... Um, I don't know. It's really just kind of knotted up. If I can kind of coax it into its shape here. What is it? Is it a dinosaur? <laughs> is it? It looks like it might be a dinosaur. I don't know. Or uh, I'm going to leave it over here on the side for now. Let's see what else we've got. Coax this into a... Oh, this is the steamship. Or the side of the yacht. That is the yacht. This one still got some plastic on it, actually. There it goes. This is the, uh, the rocket ship. Hot dog. Uh, car. Hmm. Okay. I'm going to give up on that one for now. Maybe we would have figured out by... see here that is oh that's the submarine is what that is this is the car or <laughs> I don't know and you know what I'm going to do? These that are really not kind of formed, I'm going to give them a couple of minutes. I'm going to let them form and then I'll do a final shot for everybody. But right now, if you enjoy this video for some reason, please hit the share button. Uh, hit the like button. Uh, whatever it is that uh, you do when you watch videos and you like them. And I'll see you next time. It's the Reverend Jay Goldstein. Ta-da!